welcome fam bam to the channel it's your boy gary coming at you with a random car monday so guys uh i know saturday i didn't do the live like i normally would do and i was beat it's like i, I remember i wanted to do it at four o'clock as always here and uh started watching uh what is it deadpool and wolverine and i want to fall asleep on that i heard it's supposed to be good but uh i didn't make it past anything and i just slept so i slept from 3 30 to 10 o'clock <laughs> And so the, on those days, it's mainly because of my dialysis treatment. I don't sleep there like most people do. And then I go there for like three and a half hours and I try to sleep at least the last hour and a half. And sometimes I can get it in, sometimes I don't. But enough of that said. So, but I will be attempting to do a live this coming Saturday at the same time. And as always, it, it's open to anyone that wants to get on the panel and chat. Just chat it up. All right, guys, so let's do this. So I have a bunch of random cards, guys. A bunch. You know... Let me get started first. <laughs> Before I get started, let's turn on this bad boy and get it warmed up. And the first car, guys, is one of my favorite castings. And that is the Riviera. Let's see if we can slow it down a little bit more. There we go. I love me a Rivy. Next one, guys, we're coming up. It's going to be the GT40. Or Ford GT, put it that way. So, the thing was, my plan was to do. Uh, Mopar Monday. <laughs> but then I started looking at all these cars and like, hey, why not show them? I mean, as always, guys, hope you enjoy this. Give your boy a thumbs up if you made it this far. So let's kick it. With this big old land yacht, this big old caddy. I have to see how many Cadillacs I actually have in my collection. I, I, what I need to do is get maybe two empty cases and just go through everything and start moving stuff around. I'm quite sure by the time I'm done, I have a lot of empty spots, mm -hmm. but at least I would know what's in everything. Even though I can find everything I want, it would just make it a lot easier. So if you feel it once, do it twice. Not a big lanyard, not a big caddy. But 
So I hope you guys had a great weekend. Found what you were looking for out there in these diecast world, <laughs> diecast streets. Put it that way. And uh, and enjoying what you guys are definitely follow, finding. Because I have seen a lot of guys found us with this Q case. Yeah, I can't find anything until I start getting rid of stuff. Next, guys. We got another one of my favorites. And that is the Chevy Nova. So that, like, when I say random, these are going to be random. There's no order. We just putting them up. So you're gonna see cars from old school, to new school, and ever in between. Here we go. Let's kick it. By the charger. Yeah, it's part of the Mopar, Mopar thing, right? Like I said, I started off, I wanted to do Mopar, but hey, it kind of like got away and, and wanted to do its own thing. And I'm okay with that. Next one, guys. I haven't shown in a while, and that is the Maverick Grabber. You have to go deep into your collection. <laughs> and I just popped open the case and whatever was in that case, I am showing you guys. Just like Dodge Charger. So hopefully you guys, I put some of you guys' favorite up there. I hope I kind of like tried to cover everything except for uh, sport cars. Well, high-end cars. So definitely try to keep it the old school. Like for this instance, it's 57 Chevy. It's ready to hit the tracks. I am so sorry. I put the wrong car up, called it the wrong thing. Because I do have a. I'm sorry. The car that I showed you guys was not the Dodge Charger. It is. The 
Darts Dart. I do have a red Darts charger, but this ain't it. So that is the Darts Dart. Correction, everybody. Correction. Because I was looking at the Darts charger <laughs> when I was putting this up. That because I'm sure if I wanted to put the charger up or the Chevy up because they're all sp spaced out here on this floor on the table but so here is the the charger guys Next one, guys. It's the Chevy Camaro. Mustang. What's what? What's this? Put you up. Do the custom auto auto. I can tell you guys, random. Was in the case. You guys are seeing it. I like doing videos like that. Just grab a case, whatever was in it, and I show you guys. It's it's fun because it's not something that's planned. Another Camaro. Okay, now guys, we are down to three cars. And we're gonna call it a wrap. Or four cars. We have the Firebird. Here's a Firebird I haven't shown. It's only the last time I put this on the screen. It 
to you never know what's in the case until you pull it out and check it out. GTX And as always guys if you enjoyed the video and if you, again if you made it this far I uh, appreciate you guys taking the time to check us out. Uh, don't forget to give, a, give your boy a thumbs up. And if you have a favorite, put it in the comment section. And while you're in the comment section, guys, please check out some of the other people that, that's in there. Maybe you haven't subscribed to them yet, but uh, give it a shot. <laughs> give it a shot. And check them, uh, check them out. Uh, you guys have some great videos, some great cars. You may see something that you haven't seen before. And I'm telling you, there's a lot of channels out there that's doing these videos. And there's some stuff I haven't seen before. But that's why we check it out each other. So the last one, guys, is the Thunderbolt. This is another one I haven't put on for a while. So guys, again, thank you for watching. Hope you have an awesome day today. And if you're hunting, hopefully you have a good find. You find some good stuff out there. All right, guys, until the next one, guys. This is your boy, Gary. I am signing off. And uh, again, I appreciate you stopping in. And one more thing, if you haven't subscribed, please think about doing it. Deuces. I am out, guys. Bye now.